My name is Matt Taylor. I'm the visualization engineer for the Alabama Department of Transportation. And we're here at the Year in Infrastructure Awards to uh, present our I-59, I-20 interchange project. Uh, it is a uh, large project that's in Birmingham, Alabama. It's one of the largest projects that Alabama has ever taken on. It's the most expensive and it's the most busiest corridor in the state of Alabama. So over the past uh, 40, 50 years, the existing infrastructure there has started to deteriorate. Uh, the bridges have started to show their age. Uh, it's become very dangerous as the, the traffic has increased with the, uh, with the population growth in Birmingham. So uh, plans were made to rebuild the existing interstate through downtown Birmingham. Uh, as of right now, we have it fenced off because actual concrete was falling from the bridge onto cars and pedestrians. So we had to fence it up and it kind of restricted north and south business district uh, from, from going to each side. So it's kind of been a big, a big environmental issue, also an engineering uh, problem. So we initiated this project and uh, it's, it requires uh, many ramps and bridges to be replaced. Uh, we're coming through with a sectional bridge through the main section. We're planning on raising the bridge up high, reducing the amount of columns, and uh, really opening up downtown Birmingham uh, for the environment. Not only that, but access, uh, get rid of some bad weaving sections, and also uh, provide a more safer bridge which has shoulders for uh, emergencies.